How's it going, you guys? Test real good. Hope I didn't fail your test today. Otherwise, you'll be playing Pikmin 3 Deluxe or DX. Uh, I actually just went in straight and said it. But since we finished the entirety of Collect Treasure, now I have the entirety of Battle Enemies, which is another 15 stages that we have to clear. Now, this is... I feel like the general strategy for Battle Enemies is way different than the general strategy for Collect Treasure. Because in Collect Treasure, what you really want to do is just Pikmin management. You want to make sure that you have, like, the correct number of Pikmin on each and every, like, item. That's why I, you see, like, I, I usually always throw, like, five on nuggets. Or, like, oh, like the minimum you need to carry an object. In this, you kind of want to do the, the, like, not really the opposite, but, like, don't really worry about corpses at all. And that's because, uh, you actually are given onions. And you really don't get the opportunity to, like, get, you have to scram scramble around to get enemies. No, you kind of have to make the Pikmin yourself. Which, I mean, makes these... I would say Battle Enemies is slightly easier than Collect Treasure. Because of the general idea of what you need to do. But, it's whatever. Okay, anyways, we want to pluck. Now, neat little trick is you could just kind of go like this. And then, now we are going to go for you. Go for you. There we go. Okay, so one. Uh... One, two, three. That nectar spawned in a really bad location, I will say. So one, and one. So they're gonna start working on that stuff. Now we gotta go switch over to Alf. I'm gonna do one. I'm gonna do hello. Thank you. All right. Go like this. Go like this. That should kill the bulbar, but it doesn't really matter if it kills anything else. Because uh, you know that's not really our priority. Okay, so we're still plucking. Uh, looks like Alpha's gonna be done a little bit first. I'm not gonna go for this. And then... And then... Boom! Okay, dead. Now where? There you go. And we have Ultra Spicy Sprite. Now we're gonna go over here, actually, to take out that one enemy. Uh, I am getting calls and messages and all that stuff, but now is not the time. Uh, <laughs> okay. I want to take out this butterfly or yellow specter lid as fast as possible. Grab the bomb rock and then go back and pluck. Brittany, you've got all your Pikmin. Uh, we're going to go like this. Okay, now I'm going to take out you guys and we got to be careful of this uh, baldy long legs. Uh, then we got to rush to Brittany as fast as possible. Uh, pre actually, okay, I'm gonna make you walk because I want to make sure that Brittany is safe. Yeah, here we go. Come here. Alf, I need you. Uh-oh. We might lose a couple of Pikmin here. Just not the bomb rock. Okay, good. Now we're gonna kind of just... hope. Oh. Boom. Alright, perfect. And then now we're gonna launch a couple of yellows. Okay, now this is where it kind of gets a little bit t tricky now. I'm gonna whistle you guys. Some of you guys might die, but it's okay. Uh, we have one bomb rock, which is convenient, although I do want to get rid of you. There we go. I will say the specter lids are probably the most annoying thing to get rid of. Okay, so I'm just gonna take out all three of those bulb orbs at once. And we don't have another spicy spray yet. Okay. Come on, kill it, kill it, kill it, kill it, kill it, kill it. Yes! Okay, we lost a couple of Pikmin, but it's whatever. I think, yeah, there was one Pikmin that brought something over, even though I didn't really want it to. Now, one cool thing, there's another spicy spray, although I don't think we're gonna need it. And then we got one, two, three. But not only that, we've got the... The, like, the multi long legs that gave us a lot of bomb rocks. And now we can basically just bomb rock everything. We don't really need to do much of anything else. Uh, although this swooping snitch bug might be a bit annoying if we do not deal with it, like, the normal way. Okay. Uh-oh, it's got a bomb rock. Okay, it didn't, it didn't, like, drop it, which would have made it explode if it didn't do that otherwise. Okay, so we've got that. Okay, and we're done. Mission complete. 
You all you need to do is take back the enemies, or not take back the enemies. You have to defeat the enemies. You don't need to take them back to the onion. You just need to defeat them. Uh, which generally, which I, what, that's what I mean by it's a little bit easier because you don't have to wait for something. Oftentimes, you're just kind of making sure that you just making sure you defeat all the enemies, and that I actually make be a super new record. Yep, six thousand seven hundred compared to my other scores. Uh, and I feel like I did a little bit better because I was able to get to the Baldy Long Legs window was by Brittany much faster. Because you, if you don't do that on the first go, it takes a while to like try to kill it normally. Um, but yeah. I know it was a very basic tropical forest, I didn't really explain a whole lot, but I mean, I kind of don't really get to explain a lot of things anyway. Also, I never check the rankings. Like, I don't always like to do this, but sometimes I do. And I will say, like, Battle Enemies doesn't give you as much score as Collect Treasure. That is something that's a bit interesting in a way. Well, the new- well, like, the highest record doesn't even get shown on this leaderboard, that's interesting. Or, like, my highest record. That's interesting, that is really weird. Uh, but yeah. That's kind of the general concept of battle enemies. You just kind of want to make sure that you're, that you only, like, take back like only like the enemies that are close to your base, and then don't even take back any of them at all. Just use bomb rocks or just use cheese strats to to get through the rest of the enemies. Like if you're given rock pikmin, you basically just want to only use rock pikmin a lot of stuff. And if there's like a way to cheese certain enemies, like swooping stitch bugs, just as long as you're able to like lock onto them and then throw pikmin so that they fall down, they're done for. Uh, and, like, a whole bunch of other stuff like that, but it's, that, that's, but I'm not gonna go into much detail. We're just gonna get through the rest of these missions, uh, whenever we get to them. But yeah, I'm ending it here, so thank you for watching, and I'll see you another time. You let an eight ball fall. Goodbye!